Um, Dr. Strawn, um, like, I have a question. Why do we have nose hair? Is that really necessary? <laughs> well, you know, one of the ways you learn about the function of something is when someone has a condition when it's absent. And there's a medical condition called uh, alopecia, alopecia universalis, where someone loses all the hair on their body. So we have hair all over us, except in our palms, eyelids, and our soles. And, um, but some of it's vellus hair, very fine hair that we don't necessarily notice. And we have it in our nose, as some of us can see and not see. So one of the symptoms that people complain a lot about who have this condition is that they feel like they have allergies all the time. They have sinusitis all the time. Because your nose hair is trapping allergens and particles and pollutants in the air that, you know, and keeping them from getting up into your sinuses and causing you to react. So that's part of the function of nose hair. Great. All right. Well, thank you so much. Thank you.